Lock Henry, one of the spookiest episodes of Black Mirror's newest sixth season, has perplexed and shocked audiences ever since it debuted on the streaming service. Young filmmakers Pia and Davis set out to produce a nature documentary, but their plans are quickly derailed by a cold case crime in Davis's small Scottish hamlet of Lock Henry. They come into the shocking truth right near the end of the episode as they work along with Davis's old buddy Stuart to figure out why murderer Ian Adair tortured and killed multiple victims over the years. It's slowly revealed that Janet, Davis's seemingly well-meaning mother, is concealing a dark secret of her own, and together with her husband, police officer Kenneth, recruited Adair to help them torture and kill all of those people. The episode ends with the shocked deaths of Pia, who stumbles on a rock in a stream, and also of Janet, who hangs herself and leaves a stack of incriminating videos and memorabilia for Davis to use in his documentary. The final scenes of the episode show that Davis has made his documentary, which wins Best Factual Series at the BAFTAs. But although it's a time of celebration for many involved, Davis is left to drink champagne alone in his hotel room. The final shot is of a teary-eyed Davis staring at his BAFTA award, which, of course, is a mask. While in an interview episode stars Harold and Blenken were quizzed about the double meaning of the mask at the end. Of course, it bears a striking resemblance to the red masquerade mask Janet wore when she committed suicide by hanging herself, as well as her appearance in the terrible torture tapes. Harold remarked on the similarities, good catch, and Blenken said, yes, I think you're absolutely right. There is a theme there about the stories we tell other people about who we are, and my mother's character in the musical has this story she has been telling herself about who she is, he said. There is unquestionably a connection between that and the items mentioned, including masks. Charlie Brooker questions our beliefs about streaming in Joan is Awful, Loneliness in Beyond the Sea, Intrusive Paparazzi in Maisie Day, and our darkest, most insular thoughts in Demon 79 among other similarly unsettling episodes from season 6. Locke Henry's closing scene, Davis takes one last look at his mother's note. For your film. Mum. He then looks at his BAFTA award and cries, pondering the events that led him to his current situation. Janet's note makes Davis's ending even more tragic as it hints at how his mother tried giving him a semblance of closure by letting him use her dark past to become an accomplished filmmaker. However, to Davis's dismay, the production likely took that away from his as well, by only acknowledging him as a victim in the crime, but still using trauma and grief for commercial gains. The people involved in the development of Locke Henry Truth Will Out do not seem to care about Davis and how the documentary might have affected him. Even Davis's friend, Stuart, basks in the success of the documentary film because it brings more customers to his pub. Meanwhile, Davis looks at his BAFTA and wonders if finding the truth was really worth it, given how he lost his mother and girlfriend, but gained a little fame and a meaningless award trophy. Ironically, even the BAFTA award is designed like a mask, and the streaming platform Streamberry, where the documentary premieres in the Black Mirror's Locke Henry, is a Netflix parody.